welcome back to Google Time. And I yes, I know the short didn't get 20 likes and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I still want to try it out to see if you guys actually like it. So let's get five likes, okay? Five likes on this video until next upload. So you have a week. One week to get this video to five likes. And I'll make this a series. So anyways, like I said... Sprocket is a um, tank building game where you get to customize and build your own tank. Like right here, this is no tank, no tanks land, which I had such a hard time getting through. And then you have ambush, which is pretty easy. Dunes, which is also well, it's not pretty easy. Silent border, haven't completed that one yet. Railway, did do that. The crossroad, nope. Fields. Nope. Tega? Nope. Defense? Nope. So the only one I finished was Ambush. Which is the one we're going to be doing today. <clears throat> so pretty much, yeah, you have a game, you have a tank. A single chassis, and then you have to take a turret. Take this turret. Set it right there. Now, you see these, like, dots? Those are, like, how I customize it. So I can make it really sloped. Like that. Or I can make it really flat. Like that. And then it shows over over here everything about it. So I can go to armor and I can increase the armor on it. So I can go to 60 millimeters in the front and 60 millimeters in the rear and all that. The baskets, how like much your turret can carry, which is up here. So the hull of our tank can hold 9.42 and it is already 8.264. Full. My turret has nothing in it, which is what we're going to be doing. We take a mantlet. Oh, yeah, and here's like this is like symmetry and then overlays and rotation. But now we have to add a mantlet for our gun. So let's take a mantlet, let's put it on our turret. And now over here is like the sub menus for the menu. So right now, gun mount completed that. Now I go to cannon. Now I can change the caliber. I can make it 250 which is pretty big or I can make it 20 we're just gonna keep it at 88 uh, shell length is like how far I'm guessing I don't know what this does what's velocity I don't know I usually keep it at 400 uh, the segments is like different segments and you can have them recoiled or have it not and you can change the length right here so two so 1.5, and then 1. So this is a pretty long barrel, as you can see. And then the thickness, that I like is just to have it at 70, and then decrease it by 15. 70, and then it goes to 55. Then it goes to 40. Well, and actually then decrease it by 20 every segment. Then it goes to 35, and then that goes to 20. And then the last one goes to 10. And then you add a muzzle for aesthetics, which here's a T muzzle right there. Yeah, one thing I don't like is you have to click the middle button for like the scroll wheel. You have to push that down to actually look at your tank. I don't like that. I don't know how to change it, but I don't like it. And then yeah, so now I'm gonna make the turret a bit bigger. So do that, do that, do that, do that. And then move it back. So it looks a bit nicer. Now crew is like all the aesthetics and all that. I don't really go for that, but if I'm feeling really bored, I'll just do one. So add a storage compartment, cause why not? Uh, add it like, uh, right, um, one, right there. Uh, it's pretty short. So now we're gonna do that, do that. Now I'll go back to crew and re-add it and it'll look like a hundred times better. There much better now I have to add a commander's cupola for the commander so I'm gonna add that right here so that's where a commander sits so that's the loader that's the gunner the driver as you can see is there's a little spot that means because that's because I have to add the driver's port right there so now if I were to go here I have a fully functional tank hold on there there we go i forgot to turn down the volume sorry guys but yeah so now we have a fully functional tank 
And look at this enemy. Oh, oh yeah, I don't have any armor. I need armor, guys. <laughs> or someone's getting demolished. <sighs> Alright, so we're gonna make the front 50, cheek 50, and the roof 35. Oh yeah, Ar also, armor also takes up this storage thing. And then there's the weight. There's the name. That's the name. Um, side, we're gonna make it 50. 50, and then 35. 50, 50, then 35. Oh yeah, this is, this is for the ring, so I can make it really tall. For like a ring, but I don't really wanna do that. So now, shrink it back down. I can increase the armor thickness. The basket space, I can have it really much, really big or really not. I don't know. And then you have to go to mobility. I can customize the tracks. I can have them look like this. I can have a different suspension. You can have that suspension. I can get rid of the return rollers. So now there's no return rollers. Um, I can decrease the diameter of the act, the road wheels, or I can increase it. Yeah, it's it. This game is fully customizable. And I increase the height of like the actual body, so now I can actually add the stuff. But with the suspension, you want the return rollers. So then push that up. Push that up. Push that up. Increase the spacing so that's how far apart they are. Move it over a bit. There. Now I have to add the engine. So I can have a light engine, a medium engine, or a heavy engine. Well, I'm going to have a medium engine. And then I have to add the exhaust. So we're going to put that right there. Oh yeah, and then you could shrink it as well. See? <laughs> Shrinked. Now I can add vents. You need to make sure the engine stay co stays cool, don't you? Yeah. There. You're gonna add some uh, add a fan right there, <clears throat> right between the exhausts, so the you have like a supercharged engine. No, not really. Oh yeah. I forgot to say I have a cold. <laughs> All right. So now let's try. I forgot the hull armor. <laughs> I forgot to add armor to the hull. Belly is like right underneath, don't need that. Roof, 35, and everything else, 60. I forget to do that, there, there. So now I can only have one tank because, yeah, it's weird how that works, but like if I exceed a, like a number of objects, the number of tanks I can have go down, and the other tanks are ran by AI, of course. See, there's that enemy, so watch. Watch this. Watch me obliterate it with my 88. 88 millimeter. Pow! Gone. Come on, come on, come on. Move, 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 move. Uh. Die. Goo, got him. Die. Oh, he didn't die. He didn't die. Uh, die! He died. Die! Oh, you need to die too? Okay. Ah! I missed. Anyways, go, go, go! I'm gonna finish this. Ah! Dang it. Go. <clears throat> Did I kill him yet? No. Why won't you just die? Come on, die. Die. There we go. Oh, there's the last tank. You want to die also? Okay. I won! <laughs> Alrighty. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Let's get five likes from this week period. And I hope you enjoy. Well, no, on, let me rephrase that. Let's get five likes on this video. And well, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.